Aldis Burzins Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined with Aldis Burzins, head coach of the men's volleyball team. And coach, it's been a long week in the CVC for you guys, all on the road. You guys start out at Marymount, finish out at Teal and Juniata, pulling out two of the three. First of all, talk about that uh, Marymount game that went five sets. Yeah, that was uh, a heartbreaker. Um, we uh, lost the first two sets and then came back in the third and fourth and had all the momentum and <laughs> But ended up losing in the fifth, and uh, so it was a, you know, a growing moment for our team. You know, we learned that we need to close mm -hmm. and, and focus um, in that fifth set. And yeah, then we didn't have a big break. We uh, went away to Juniata, uh, and they're they're ranked, and that was just a wonderful win. Mm -hmm. um, there, the guys uh, played really well, and. Uh, in particular, we were missing Mike Fears, who's out with the flu at the Marymount game and also versus Juniata. And, and uh, Nick uh, Gross stepped up and played outside and did a great job. Um, and that one was in four. Yeah, we won that one in four. <laughs> Thank goodness it didn't go five. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't be here. Uh, and then the Teal match wasn't easy either. They had given trouble to a lot of teams, you know, taking a couple from uh, Marymount and um, – some sets from EMU so they were really a scrappy team and a long drive away but we ended up winning 3-0 and so we're in a pretty good position right now um, to, to keep moving forward. When you talk about Nick stepping up in the boot uh, bootstraps of Michael Fears uh, you know those are that's been the theme of all season is it's going to be the next man up the whole team's going to get action and they're all going to play meaningful <laughs> points for you. Uh, yeah that's um, what I what I like to see is that you know the guys that you know aren't on the floor that they're uh, pushing the guys that are in practice and then when they get their opportunity in the match they step up. Um, Avery uh, also uh, stepped up, uh, in, uh, playing back row and serving for Nate Ellis who had a got a big thumb like a mm -hmm. Flintstone <laughs> sprain um, from one of our own players in practice and wasn't able to serve and uh, was spiking the ball and then going, ah. But, uh, you know, Nate played through the injury and Avery played in the back row for him. Sandy uh, came in to serve great, also jump serving against Teal, scoring points and against Juniata. So, yeah, that I think everybody kind of knows my coaching style mm -hmm. now that I'll <laughs> at any moment say, get in there, and they're, they're ready. That's definitely uh, necessary going into this weekend's game against Stevens back at home. It's going to be your last match until almost the end of March. Mm -hmm. How important does this match, what does this match mean to you going into this long spring break? Well, it's it's huge. They're in the top four nationally, and uh, we need to do well out of conference um, for our seeding in the future. Um, so, and they're, yeah, they've pretty much beaten up beating up on everybody uh uh and uh you know we haven't played them before or i haven't and i'm watching the video mm -hmm. and trying to prepare the scouting report and we have them in, in our home gym so um although that doesn't seem to be an issue anymore i thought for a while our gu guys were like <laughs> thinking uh we can only win in our home gym but that those uh you know the juniata and teal wins were huge and away and uh yeah, they realize they can play just as well um, away as they can at home. So, you know, I'm hoping for a big crowd on Friday. It's at 6 p.m., <laughs> not 7. So come on down the hill and uh, fill the gym up and cheer for us. Yeah, we're looking forward to it, Coach. And you guys have had a pretty long streak, uh, winning streak in our own gym at Owings Mills Gymnasium. Yeah, yeah, that <laughs> – I don't know. Yeah, that's good. We'll defend that. Yeah. I, I'm hoping that uh, – and the guys just play their best game like mm -hmm. they have been, and uh, they get to show what they can do. And uh, we end up with a win before spring break. Well, we're looking forward to it, Coach, and we wish you the best of luck on Friday. Okay, thanks. He's Aldous Burzins. I'm Joe Wamba. This has been the Aldous Burzins Show. Thanks, Joe.